right guys, good morning. So, slept in a Walmart parking lot last night. Uh, did not get the best sleep. The lights obviously stay on 24 seven in that parking lot and uh, there were just tons of like loud trucks and stuff. Um, we made it and uh, I tried to look for a rest stop. It brought me to some random guy's house. So <laughs> I pulled into this Target here. Uh, I just brushed my teeth, got changed and everything here. There's another camper actually right behind me. Let's get ready for the day. Now we're finally gonna do the Manitou Incline Steps in Colorado. Um, should be a fun little hike. So I'll take you guys along with me and uh, see where this video goes. Made it to Manitou Incline, kind of. Um, had to park about a mile out. Because uh, it was the only place with RV parking. So I'm starting to learn that it's really hard to find places to park this thing. Because <laughs> all these hikes are like right outside the city. So we're going to go try to pay for the parking and get off from there. So we got on the bus, um, should be just like a mile to the Manitou Incline now, and then uh, we start hiking, baby. Let's do it. Alright man, thank you so much, I appreciate it. Impressive driving, man. I'm from right around New York City, and this is more impressive than there, so. <laughs> impressive. Couldn't really notice <clears throat> the elevation change. Just walking up the hill to get to the incline. Just found a, a couple of cool friends along the way. Two guys from the army. Always better to hike together than alone. I went to rest a little bit, so I kept going. But, uh, it's an amazing trail. How you doing? Good, how are you? Yeah. This is no joke, <clears throat> I can get this elevation. <clears throat> we gotta be getting close, because I see the uh, tree line starting to wear thin up here. I don't know where this goes to. I'm gonna follow a little bit. It's starting to snow a little bit. I don't know if it's catching that on camera. <laughs> it's about 65 degrees in town. That shows you, it gives you a little bit of an idea of how high up we are. <laughs> Hi, how you doing? Good, how you doing? Good.
right? <clears throat> Another successful hike in the books. That was pretty tough, but uh, it was awesome, man. Um, so now we're heading down. I can catch the bus back to where my car's parked. And that's it. I think I did strain or pull something like my Achilles. Back of my heel, it's hurting pretty bad, but hey, man. All in all, that was an amazing hike. We must have missed the entrance somehow to the actual steps because as you could see, we hiked the trail all the way up and came to the top of the steps. Um, so I don't know where I missed that, but honestly, it was an amazing hike. So let's go get some food and get on with the day. So I decided to walk down rather than catch the bus. Um, in town, it looked like there were some cool little places to eat. So check some of them out and uh, enjoy some of the scenery in the meantime. You know, it's funny because when I'm not doing activity, I get a lot hungrier. I think it's like bored hungry versus when I'm hiking. It's already one o'clock and I'm hungry, but I'm not starving. All right, guys, made it down from the Manitou incline. I think I did something like the back of my heel. My leg hurts or my heel hurts pretty bad, but uh all in all, man, amazing hike. That was really gorgeous. Um, we're headed off to the Great Sand Dunes National Park now. Probably gonna grab some food along the way. I just ate a little burger, um, but grab something to cook up for tonight. And and then, yeah, I guess uh, do some great sand duning tomorrow, baby. Should be a good time. I've wanted to see this for a long time, so should be fun. Driving to Great Sand Dunes National Park. Uh, about 55 miles away, and this is what it looks like up ahead, so let's hope this clears up a little bit. Guys, it is now completely snowing. Um, I gotta start doing some more research before I hit these places. Alright guys, we are now in the descent. Obviously I have my truck in four wheel drive that does not really help with stopping them and uh, I have a trailer pushing me so a little nerve wracking but I think we're going to make it. I don't know really where this leads to. That's definitely not good. Don't want to jinx us but I think we're finally starting to make it down as you can see. Starting to warm up a tiny bit. The roads aren't as snowed on. Got a little more black to them, so I think we're finally starting to get to the bottom. Let's hope to God we don't have to go back up again. But uh, looks like we're gonna be all right. Sunlight, baby, sunlight. I think we made it. All right, guys, so we made it down that little snowstorm into a town called Blanca and uh, found a little RV site. This guy's super cool, $40 a night, uh, and they have everything. I didn't even realize I thought they'd have nothing, but they have power, they have water, they have showers. Um, so I might even spend two nights here, check out the sand dunes more. Uh, but yeah, pulling in right now, we'll disconnect and cook up a nice dinner for tonight.
hard angle. Alright guys, so let's try a bite of this here. Try not to make the smoke alarm go off again. Did it again. Hmm. Another banger. Alright, guys, I'm gonna eat this up. And then, uh, do some editing, get to work. Turn the heat on soon. And yeah, I think it's been a pretty great day. Stressful, but been pretty awesome. So, thank you guys for coming with me on this journey once again. And, uh, see you when it's time to go to bed. All right, guys, so <clears throat> I'll finish with that dinner. Really good. Uh, got the heat going here. It's about 28 degrees right now. It's supposed to drop to like 19 tonight, so definitely a good night to get the heat going. Uh, but yeah, just uh, watching some football. Going to start editing soon. And um, overall, amazing day, man. Manitou Incline was an absolutely incredible hike. Um, <laughs> a little stressful going over that snowy mountain, but we made it. And uh, yeah, this is awesome. I, I can't wait to see some of the great sand dunes and uh, show you guys what this place is all about. So thank you once again for coming with me on this journey. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to another episode of Crowfoot. Uh, it means the world to me. I got more really good stuff coming. The last few days have been a little rocky, but we made it out. So uh, good stuff is to come. I appreciate you guys again. Uh, tune in next time for more, and I appreciate you guys.